Well, would you looky here? We have an R6. And we have parts, and also my feet. Um, what's going on, guys? Long time no see. Obviously, I've been really busy to the point where this thing has been off the road for more than six months now. Um, I don't have much time today. I have to go to work um, in the works. I do have woodcraft frame sliders, which are going on. Um, chain sprocket kit. Exhaust is coming. I get a Danmoto carbon GP exhaust coming. Um, right now, we're going to do Renthal dual compound grips. Get rid of these things finally. And I went ahead and bought some Shogun bar end sliders to put on the end of those. Um, I also have rim tape. Oh god, I bought a bunch of crap. But right now, I have enough time to get the... Wow, my screen shut off on me. Get the the grips and the sliders done. So, let's see if I can somehow do this. Is this gonna work? It actually might. Screw it, we'll go with it. All right, um, there's two ways to get your grips off. If you do have an air compressor, you can um, take a hose with a little compressor, put some air in between here and your clip on, the grip will slide right off. I'm just going to do it the old-fashioned way, take a razor blade, make a few cuts going down it. And your grip just kind of peels off. Jesus. There we go. All right, grip number one off. Let me get something to clean that with. I wish I had some of that goo gone stuff. Yeah. I don't know if that's gonna be a problem or not. Yeah, it shouldn't be. Well, that just made it worse. Fuck it. All right. I don't have grip glue. I'm going the old-fashioned way. Grew up racing motocross. This is the way to go. If you didn't have grip glue anyway. So I'll do a little... Make sure we're right side up. You don't want to be all the way up, smashed against your controls here. That looks about right. I just want my damn grip to be straight. I think that will do.
Now those are going to stick out a little bit just because they are sliders. I need to get my big wrench actually, those might go in a little bit further. Those threads are dirty as shit. Now because I'm an idiot and didn't put something around that, I marked it all up. Uh, five mil T-handle for the screw. I really should have put some cloth around that or something. And that will do it. That sticks out a lot, doesn't it? Wow, that sticks out a whole lot. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing yet. Oh, that grip feels nice. Eh, it's not terrible. I figure the old one probably could used to come out to about here-ish anyway. Yes, I like it. Those Renthal grips, man, you cannot beat those. If you guys uh, have still have something like that, those just the stock hard things, and you want something cushy, go with those. These are the, the larger outer diameter. I think, uh, oh God, I'm not sure what size they are. They're not just the, the race grips. They're the dual, dual compound, not the Kevlar kind. Just a regular dual compound with a larger outer diameter on it. It's got that diamond pattern, but that is really squishy, and I like it. That hairspray already set pretty good, too. Hell yeah. Let's do the other side.